Good evening. Hello, hello, can you hear me? Hello, hello. Good evening. Hello, hello. One, one, two, three. Hello. Hello. Okay, hello. welcome. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening to everyone. Let's start another English class. This, this is teacher Rodrigo. And today we're gonna start class number seven. Seven? No, eight. Class number eight. Well, in the previous class, we studied a little bit about the adjective plus the word enough. Okay, the word enough. So please get ready. Okay, get your manual close to you because we're going we're gonna to use it. Okay, uh, we're going to review the reading that we had yesterday. And the reading says, the competitor just released a clone of our headphones. They are attractive enough to make us lose positioning in the market. What do we do? We could renew the look of our headphones. Let's make them colorful enough so that people can recognize them easily. We can also try with an advertising campaign. Renewing the look and packaging will take months. And advertising campaign is too expensive. The best thing we can do is to change our pricing strategy. It's fast enough to help our counter or competitors release of their products. Okay. For example, do you remember the meaning? Do you remember the meaning of the word release? What does release mean? Release. What does release mean? Hello? Hello, hello? What does release mean? Okay, how about, let me see, what does? Release is uh, lanzamiento. Lanzamiento, okay, yeah. El lanzamiento, eh, entrega. Entrega. All right, release. For example, when is going to be the next class released? The next course released. When is going to be the next, the next um, homework released? Okay, the word release. Also, we have the word attractive, attractive. What does attractive mean? What does attractive mean? Attractive. Attractivo. Attractive, okay, good job. Excellent. Uh, good job. Let me see. And how about attractive enough? Attractive enough. Attractive enough. I remember the pronunciation of this word. It is enough. It isn't enough. It is enough. 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 With an F. Exactly. Okay. What does what does market mean? Market. It is, have you, I'm pretty sure you have heard that, that word before. For example, market place. But what does market mean? Market, M-A-R-T-E-T. 
K E T. Market. Also, we have supermarkets. What is your favorite supermarket that you usually visit? Your favorite supermarket. My favorite supermarket is Super Selectos. Super Selectos, okay. Super Selectos. Good. So market, in simple words, it is a place where we can buy like uh, food okay, and other things that we usually do at home or by cleaning ourselves. Okay. Also, we have um, colorful. Colorful. That is an adjective. What is colorful? Well, it's a piece of thing or an object or an idea, a noun okay, that it has a lot of color colors and it's very attractive. Attractive. Okay, also we have the verb recognize. What does recognize mean? Recognize. What does recognize mean? Recognize. What does recognize mean? Reconocer. Exactly. And what is what what is what is the simple past tense of recognize? What is the simple past tense? Recognized. Recognized with a T at the end. All right. Recognized. For example, you can recognize. A colorful market <laughs> seen far away, desde muy lejos, or from far away. Okay. Also, we have advertising. Yesterday, we studied this word. What does advertising mean? What does advertising mean? I'm sorry? Publicidad. Exactly. Okay. Publicidad. Very good. And the word campaign. Campaign. We have political campaign. We have advertising campaign, recycling campaign, health campaign, etc. Okay. Well, um, how about Mr. Luis? Can you please read the part as Antonio, please? And oh. can you? Uh, uh, no problem, Mr. All right. I got it. How about Miss Claudia Yvonne? I don't know if she can help us to read the part as Renee. Okay. All right. Ready? Okay. Three, two, one, action. The competition just released a clone of our health funds. They are attractive enough, enough to make us lost positioning in the market. What do we do? We could renew the look of our health phones. Let's make them colorful enough so that people can recognize them easily. We can also try white and advertising campaign. Renewing the look and uh, packaging will take a month and uh, Amber Tasting a campaign is too expensive. The best thing we can do is to change our pricing strategy. It's fast enough to help use counter or competitors release of their products. Excellent. Good pronunciation, Miss Claudia and Mr. Luis. Okay, how about now? Miss Cristina, can you please help us to read the part as Antonio? Okay. All right. And how about Miss Rosibel? As can you please read the part, the Renette part, please? Okay, teacher. Ready? Yes. Okay. Let's start. Three, two, one. Action. 
The competition just released a clan of our health funds. Mm -hmm. They are attracted enough to, to what? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. To make us <laughs> to make us lose positioning in the market. What do we do? We could re renew the look of our health funds. Let's make them colorful enough so that people can you recognize them easily so that people can recognize them? Oh, sorry. We can also. We can also uh, try with an advertising okay. with campaign. An, an advertising campaign. Excellent. Renewing the look and packaging would take months, and an advertising campaign is too expensive. The, be the best thing we can do is to change our pricing as tragedy. It's fast enough to help us conquer our competitor competitors realize release. Of their release of their products. Excellent. Thank you very much for your participation. Okay, well, uh, now the sentences that we saw yesterday. For example, number one, they are? Attractive, they are enough. Attractive, enough. attractive enough to make to make us lose ground in the market. Let's make them? Colorful. Colorful. Enough. Colorful enough so that people can recognize them easily. Very good. How about number three? It's fast enough. I'm sorry? It's what? It's fast enough. Fast, fast enough. enough. Fast enough. Fast enough. Very good. Fast enough. Okay. Nope. I'm sorry? Fast enough, teacher. Fast enough. <clears throat> okay, very good. Let me see. Okay. Uh, so when we have an adjective, what, where is the position of enough? Is it before the adjective or after the adjective? If it is, if it is an adjective, for example, fast, uh, expensive, dangerous. It's after, after the, adjective. the adjective. And if it is a noun, for example, place, a thing, an idea before. before exactly before excellent okay well also we you create two sentences per each brand how about lg does any can anybody read the sentence with lg brand What are the what are the sentences? Tell me the sentences that you created yesterday with LG brand. LG is competitive enough. LG, it is competitive enough. Very good. LG, it is competitive enough. Another sentence? Sunny Expedia. Good enough. Good enough. I'm sorry? Sun, sunny Xperia. Sunny Xperia. Good enough. I'm sorry? Good enough. Good. Good enough. 
Ah, is good. Is good. Enough. Not. Good. Good enough. Good, good enough. enough. All right. Excellent. How about another sentence using San Xperia? San Xperia. Is user friendly enough? I'm sorry. Uh, Sony Ex Sony Xperia uh -huh. is uh, is user friendly enough? Okay, enough. user friendly enough. Very good. How about iPhone? Hi iPhone. iPhone it's very it's expensive. Expensive, expensive enough. enough. Okay. It's not accessible enough. Okay, it is not accessible enough. What do you prefer, people? It's iPhone or uh, Android? Android. 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 Okay. In your in your daughter or your son? In case you have. <laughs> Android too. Well, I have used both and I like more iPhone. Okay, how about Samsung? Tell me some characteristics of Samsung. Is popular enough? It's popular enough. Yeah, very, very popular. And now it's quite expen it's quite expensive as iPhone. Okay, another another sentence. Another sentence. Using Samsung. The Samsung case is colorful enough than other brands. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Thank you very much for your participation. Okay. Uh, let me see. Yesterday also we, well, you did it as an exercise. Okay, using uh, enough. Okay. Hold on. Where it is? I'm sorry. I'm I'm looking for the exercise. Okay, tell me two sentences using adjective plus enough, only two. Tell me two sentences. Two sentences using adjective plus enough. Mr. Luis, do you have your sentence or only one? Mm. Uh, not yet, Mr. Not yet. Okay, Miss Miss. Um, how about Miss Sandra? Miss Cristina? Miss mm -hmm. Cecilia? <laughs> Mr. Manuel? Miss Karen? <laughs> All right. 
Ms. Cloud. My dear teacher. Teacher, I have a, a question. Tell me your question. Uh, uh, yesterday, I don't uh, stay in class. Okay, you didn't. But, okay, I didn't. Excellent. <laughs> Thank you. But uh, I think uh, I can use the uh, enough word uh this uh this form uh, um for example uh, i i can say uh for example i don't have enough sugar to make a cake exactly you don't have enough sugar to make a cake uh enough sugar enough sugar but that is a noun. Eso es un, un noun, no es un objeto. Pero si es un adjetivo, tiene que, tiene que decir eh, fast, fast enough, colorful enough. Pero en ese caso eh, va antes. Enough sugar. Enough, enough. Eh, uh, ok. Eh, todavía no está el video, ¿verdad? Eh, yes, it is. No, yo lo busqué. Voy en serio. Tarde. Sí, no, I uploaded no sé. today. Today okay. at 5 p.m. Okay. Well, <laughs> well, maybe they maybe it is ready. I guess it's ready like 10, 10 p.m. But I, I need to learn uh, when uh, the enough uh, use. Uh, okay. The, so let's but, let's for example. Uh, the word enough means suficiente, right? Okay, no problem. So if you use an adjective, example, fast, uh, tall, delicious. Okay, the position of enough, it is uh, after. Okay. Like fast, fast enough, enough. Fast well enough. enough. But if it is a noun, a noun can be a person, a place, a thing, an animal, an object. So the position, it is after. Uh, For example, enough sugar, like you said. Sugar is a noun okay. because it doesn't describe anything. Okay. okay. Uh, no. I'm going to share with you a link. Here you have this link. For uh, adjective, uh, uh, the, the adjective, enough is... Uh, the adjective is something that describes. It's a word okay. that describes. For example, fast, tall, delicious. High and enough, the noun? for example. Tell me, tell me. High enough? High enough. Uh -huh. Yes, high, high, alto. High yeah. enough, right? High mm -hmm. enough. Fast enough. My car is fast. fast enough to get to my home. Es suficientemente rápido para llegar a casa. Or my... I am handsome enough for my wife. <laughs> Maybe for your wife it is enough, but for someone else it isn't. Um, okay. With the word handsome, we are describing, right? But let's do the exercise that I left in the, in the chat. Mr. Another question. Tell me, tell me. Uh, enough is uh, used in a decir. Se lo voy a decir en español porque me trae. Okay, don't do it. Okay, okay. Right. do it, do it, do it, do it. No problem. Y cuando se utiliza, eh, y, y lo siento por los demás compañeros, pero necesito, no, no quiero redundar, pero lo desconozco. Y okay. si lo utilizo eh, en oraciones interrogativas, is it enough? Uh, is it is it tall enough? Is it fast enough? Is it? Siempre se mantiene el mismo word. Yes. Okay. Thank you, Mister. Anytime. Okay. Try to show the link that I left. There we can practice the structure. As you can see here, we have I didn't do either enough 
well or well enough? Number two, is there enough beer or beer enough? It's enough hot or it's hot enough? Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I left the link in the chat. Try to solve it. And in case you have any questions, okay. let me know, please. Hello, Miss Clerics, welcome. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Opening links. When you finish the exercise, let me know, please. Let me know. Okay. Thank you. Finished, teacher. Thank you, Miss. Okay, let's wait for our for your our classmates. Finish. Thank you. Let's wait for our classmate. Finish.
Finish. Finish, teacher. Okay, I'm I'm apologize, but here in by my home it's raining a lot. It's raining cats and dogs. So maybe I'm going to have some problems with the audience, some issues audience. So please uh, if I can hear you, I'm apologize. All right, uh, can we do the exercise together? Yes. Okay, it says I didn't do enough well or well enough. Well enough. Well enough. Oh, enough. Is there? And no beer. No. Enough beer. <laughs> no. No. Beer, beer enough. Beer enough. Enough beer. Enough beer. 
Enough. Enough. It's enough. Hot or hot enough? Hot, hot enough. enough. Hot, hot enough. enough. I found the exam. Easy enough. Easy enough. enough. Easy enough. They didn't or didn't sell enough, enough tickets. Oh. Not bad. It isn't good enough. Enough. Good enough. Good enough. The flat, the flat it is bridge. This means the an apartment. The what? Flat, apartment. Apartment. Uh, uh, the flat isn't big, big, enough. Big, enough. big enough. Big enough or enough big? <laughs> big, big enough. 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 For them, now they, uh, they got a child. Number eight. It's hard. hard enough. Hard enough. Hard enough. Hard enough. Number nine, there weren't enough of enough of enough, enough of. of they weren't quick enough. Quick enough. Quick enough. Quick enough. Uh, number eleven. Enough. I'm sorry, that was number ten. This is number eleven. Quick not people enough. 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 People enough. People enough. No. It people no. enough people. Enough people. Enough people or people enough? People enough. People enough. People enough. Enough people. Enough people. Enough people. Sorry. Number 12. Number 12. Enough people. Enough. Enough. And number 13. Of the. Of the. Of the. Of Jesus. Okay. Ah, okay, you got a hundred. Correct. <laughs> so here we can see the correct example of advertising. <laughs> that is power rate advertising. Okay. So we have a good, well, you have good, great, excellent. Very good. I don't know if you have any questions related with the exercise that we had today. Enough. Okay. Well, uh, building vocabulary. As usual, uh, we have the reading part, the grammar part, and today we have the vocabulary part. So we're gonna work on this exercise. Okay, can you see the exercise? Yes. 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 Good. Yes. Okay. We're going to work on it. We're going to work on it uh, in books. All right, here we go.
Ah, con los Ah, con los Ah, Okay. It's a product design. Oh, to create a new product to be sold by to bus be business. Uh -huh. business. To its customer. customers. To its customer. Customer. ¿Qué está compartiendo? Yo. <laughs> Digitation ahí el numeration. Uno. <risa> Número cuatro. To create. To create a new product. To create a new product. Yes. To create a new product. After sales service. After sales. To help and the formation that is provide sí. después de después de la venta ajá uh -huh. brand brand es el primer no, el, el segundo use, the use of a name the use of a name second second feature Sí. Eso es donde tenés el cursor. Oh. And last, the process of creating. Ya lo había hecho, pues. Sí. Ya. Qué bárbaro. <risa> Hay que revisarlo si sí, no me equivoco. Pero activo, no, está bien, yo lo veo bien. Pero se perdió lo, lo que estaba compartiendo, ¿verdad? Ahorita, un nuevo. Oh, ok, gracias. Uy. Ahí. Sí. Hi, Mister. Finish, teacher. Hello, hello. Thank you. Ah, yeah, I see you everyone. Teacher. Hi. Um, yo tengo problema con mi internet. Casi siempre al final de la clase no logro estar porque me saca. Okay, Miss. Entendemos. No se preocupen. Okay.
identity in the park. Mhm. Uh -huh. Sí, Bruno de la marca. Number three. Sí. Este es el nombre 3. Um, yeah, I mean, I think yeah. I'm going to get a lot. Just give me a moment. Use my help. I'm going to get a lot of money. I'm going to get a lot of money. Procesos posesionables, procesos creados para imagen de producto. Okay. El ayuda, la información está prove proveída los clientes a a um, producto en particular. Help me information. Los clientes han ah, okay. ah. Anfitrión. Características. Servicios postventa.
Are you done? Finish. Okay. Este, déjame teacher. Eh, el funcionamiento del producto. La tres. Ya nos encontró el teacher haciendo otra cosa. Adelante, adelante, no hay problema. We are finished the other exercise. It is hot. It's hot enough. Entonces, hot es un adjetivo. In this case, okay. I think it's hot. Let's see. Hey, teacher, you can explain the this part because I try to explain by. Más que la puedo confundir más. <laughs> a mi Cecilia. Yes. Ok, vaya mi Cecilia. Eh, acá únicamente tiene que saber la posición de la, de la palabra enough. Que enough significa... Wait. Suficiente. Significa... Okay. Enough significa suficiente. ¿Verdad? Ok, teacher. Entonces, si podemos decir que la posición va a depender de la palabra. Si es un adjetivo, ¿sabe qué es un adjetivo? Mm, no bueno, un adjetivo es una palabra que describe, por ejemplo, okay. alto, bajo, gordo, flaco, rápido, un color. Son palabras que están describiendo, uh -huh. están expresando una, una característica. Uh -huh. Si es un adjetivo, por ejemplo, bien o bueno, caliente, helado, por ejemplo, en el número 4, ¿cuál uh -huh. es el adjetivo ahí? Easy, Easy. ¿verdad? Que uh -huh. está diciendo que, está escribiendo que es fácil. Uh -huh. Entonces, si es easy, si el adjetivo va a ir antes de la palabra enough, por ejemplo, easy enough, fast enough, tall enough, well enough, strange enough. Enough. Pero si es un sustantivo, un noun, un noun, um, en ese caso, tendría que ir, la palabra enough tendría que ir antes. Por ejemplo, en el número 5. Ticket. ¿Qué está describiendo ticket? Un sustantivo. Ese sería un sustantivo, ¿verdad? Ajá. Entonces, ¿la posición sería antes o después? Eh, sería antes. Antes. Ajá, en no, en no tickets. Ajá, que no hay suficientes tickets. Ok. No sé si me di a entender o necesita que profundicemos más. Uh, sí, entendí, techo. Ok. Uh -huh. Very good. We finished the exercise six, teacher. Ok. Um, we wait for the others or we work in the the number seven. Number seven? Yes. What, what is the question? I'm sorry. Uh, we work in the exercise seven. Ah, okay. Uh, from the from this test. Oh, we finished the the test with testing. Ah, you finished the test. I, I'm sorry, I don't yes. get the question. Ah, uh, we finished the exercise six. Six from the, the textbook test. or from the textbook. test? Textbook. Ah, okay. Textbook. textbook. Okay, okay. Um, we work in the page. Anyone in the exercise seven or wait for the other? Okay. 
Uh, right now, we are in this exercise six. Yes. Uh, let's work on the exercise seven. Okay. Let's see. Y hello, hello, Sandrita, sorry. Aquí estoy, aquí estoy. We work about in the page 21, exercise 7. Ok, ahorita. Seven, ¿verdad? Yes. Ok. Ahorita, ahorita, ahorita. Ahí está. Quiero ver. Esta. Es. Uh, label the examples of the of elements found in a product strategy using the question for the box. We will quality system hardware for the students so system customers. Uh -huh. What are the selling? How will you distribute this thing to product? Estas son las preguntas y estas son las respuestas. Yes. Uh -huh. And the first is what are the selling? Eh, ¿Esta? ¿Ya está? No. Una pregunta. Escribió, que escribió algo que hiciéramos algo en ejercicio. El ejercicio 7. Ay, vaya, vaya. Pues sí, es que yo, yo vi el mensajito, pero, pero yo, yo leí el ejercicio 10. No sé de dónde. <risa> ah, pues el siguiente, Daniel. Ahorita, permiso. El 7. El que estaba diciendo Manuel. Bien, bien. Ajá, ese es el mensajito que vi. Como lo tenía como minimizado, me salí abajo. Ahí hagamos eso entonces sería dele por abajo Daniel Va, la primera dice
We build quality kitchen hardware for resist residential kitchen customers. Maria, what are you selling? In the first, Daniel. What are you selling? Customers are young American families. Who want kitchen hardware? Mm. Who are you selling to? Esa sería who will. Copiar y pegar. The first, what are, what are you? Hola. The first, hello, what are you selling? Second, eh, who are you selling to? Third, what value do you provide? Four is how will you distribute your product? And five, how will you price your product? Hello, Guillermo. Hola. Hello, Manuel. Hello, hello. Hola. Hola, hola. Ya vamos a terminar. Ya está, sí. Yes. ¿Nos quiere ayudar con el ejercicio? Claro. Vaya. ¿Quién está ahí? 
Okay. Uh, did you finish exercise seven? Six. Ah, I'm sorry, but I I sent an, a message here in the app. The first is what are you selling, right? Number two, who are you selling to? Yes, who are you selling to? Number three, what value do you provide your customers? Yes. Number four, how will you distribute your product? And five, how will you price your product? 
finish teacher are you done finish yes good okay just give me two minutes okay Will you hear? Yes. La, la tres es esa, but all will you just Está lloviendo fuerte por ahí. Yes. Only that. Only that. Es eso. Sí. Tuve que apagar y porque no escuchaba nada y no me no escuchaba más que todo. Aquí tuve que cerrar todo para poder escuchar y el micrófono lo puso a todo volumen. Bocina, ¿Ah? Manuel le digo que ponga bocina cuando escuche la clase. No, pero es que fíjese que la lluvia de ser no deja. Es bien complicado. <risa> este bueno. El consejo que me está dando Ceci, ¿va? Sí, ya, ya lo hice. Sí. ¿Qué más vamos a ya hacer? Siga con el manual. <risa> ¿Terminemos el manual? No, el manual. Vamos a ver, vamos a ver. Pero son 31 páginas, pues no son ¿Ah? muchas. Solo son 41. Ajá, no son muchas. Creo que en la otra le sigo una conversación. Sí. Vaya, bueno, dice en grupo. Identificar el producto y después el estratégico. Pasemos esa actividad. All right, well. We have the vocabulary practice and also we have the grammar, the exercise seven. Let's start doing the exercise, the exercise number six, six, six. Okay, for example, uh, the process of creating an image of a product in the minds, in the minds of consumers. Product positioning. Exactly. It is number five. Excellent. Five. Uh, five the, use, the use of a thank you, Miss Clerics. The use of a name, term, symbol of design to give a product a unique ideal in the marketplace. It is brand. Number brand three. three. Number three. Number three. Thank you, Mr. Manuel and Miss Clerics. A characteristic of a product that describes its appearance, components, capabilities. It is feature. Features, excellent. Features. Feature. Number four. Number four, okay. 
to create a new product to be sold by a business to its customer. Product design. And eventually, the help and information that is provided to customer after they have about it a particular oh, product. Number two, offer service. Number two, number two. Okay, after excellent. service. Very good, excellent. So we have the exercise, and now we need to move on to the exercise number seven. It says labeled examples. Hold on. Labeled examples of elements found in a product <clears throat> using the question from the box. How would you distribute your product? Who are you selling to? What value do you provide your customer? What are you, what are you selling? How would you price your product? Label the examples of elements found in a product strategy using the question from the box. Number one, what is the number one? We build quality kitchen hardware, hardware for re residential kitchen customers. What are, you selling? what are you selling? What are you selling? Very good. Number two, our customers are young North American families who want kitchen hardware that can stand to the wear and tear of young children. Who are you selling, are you selling to? to? What are you selling to? Number three, they are interested in materials that are safe for children and eco-friendly. What value do you provide? What value, what value do you provide to the customer? Excellent, value. Number four, value. we sell our products through a retail channel. How would you distribute your product? I'm sorry? Product. I'm sorry? How will you distribute Okay, your how product. will you distribute your product? Excellent. And our product are price per unit and are considered high end hardware solution. How will you price how your will product? product? How would you price? Very good. Excellent. Thank you very much for your participation. Okay. Okay, good. Well, in okay, I need to share with you a presentation. Hold on. I'm sorry, it's loading. Okay, but for going to the next slide, I need to share, we need to remember this info that is very, very important. Okay, um, for example, uh, we have here the past participle of some verbs. Okay, for example, gun. Tell me the infinity form of gun. The infinity form of gun. La forma, eh, la forma base del verbo en participio gun, it is? Gun. 
Go. Go. So. Sell. Sell. Read. I'm sorry, read. 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 Eat. 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 Bean. Bean. Be. Be. Okay. Excellent. Is or are. Uh, made. Make. 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 Found. Seen. Found. Find. Find. Grown. Grown. Grow. Grow. Seen. Seen. See. Spent. Sand. Spend. Left. 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 Leave. 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 Tall. Hell. Hell. Tail. Thought. Think. Thought. Think. Mm, the past participle of think is thought, but this is thought. Take. Mm -mm. Teach. No. Teach. 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 Uh, fallen. Fall. Mm -mm. Oh. <laughs> fallen. Fall. Fall, exactly. Broken. Break. 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 Built. Um, Build. Build with D at the end. Build. Here. 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 I'm sorry, sorry. It is here, here. This is the past partial. Okay, cut. 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 But. Bye. 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 Written. Right. Right. A given. Give. 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 Felt. Feel. 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 Felt. Feel. 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 Mm -mm. Feel. 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 Known. Feel. No. 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 Slept. Sleep. 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 Spoken. Speak. 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 Very good. Speak. Okay. Okay. So here we have a lot of past participle verbs. Okay. Let's practice the past participle. Remember, the past participle, we can use it in, for example, a passive voice, your favorite topic, the passive voice, the present perfect, past perfect, okay, a third conditional. You can use the past participle in those, in those tenses. Okay. So today in this class, we're going to remember, we're going to practice a lot, the past participle of the verb. Got it. Remember, we studied that topic before, but it's necessary to, to practice again. Okay, so I'm gonna share at the screen. Can you see it? Yes. Okay, for example, what is the past participle right? Wrote. 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 No, Wrote. written. Written. Wrote. Wrote. Wrote is the past, but we need the past participle. Go. Gone. 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 Go, went, gone. Okay. A, how about win? One. 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 Perfect. Then we have begin. Begun. Begun. Is it C or D? C. No. C. 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 
um, is spend. 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 Letter A. Spend. Spent with T at the end. Made. 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 Let's keep, let's keep practicing this, but the past participle of the verbs. Uh, well, let's practice handman. Let's see if you still remember how to spell words. <laughs> um, here we go. Kids do it. Spell it, spell it. Letter P. Letter P, as in yeah. pineapple. Yes. Yeah. Ah, I got it now. <laughs> Letter L. Mm, it seems you have it. Letter A. Little Y, Little E, and D. Played, exactly. Played. That is the, the past participle. Same as simple past. Play is infinitive. Played, it is past and past participle. You do, you do it at the office. Um. I'm not I'm not sure. M M as in mommy. No. W W, w. w. Nope. I'm sorry. R R R R A Nope O O T T as in tomato. Yes. Uh, is, e? is. Is it E or I? E. There L. Mm. One shot, one shot. S, S. Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, S. N. N. 
N. N. Sent. Excellent. You were very nos, close. Uh, no salvamos. Yeah. R. 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 I'm sorry. R. R. A. E. E. I. T. T. I. I. Letter C. E. V. 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 N. And D. No. Ah, v. 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 And D. Receive. Receive. Brock. B. Letter B. R. R. O. 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 Q. K. 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 E. D. M. D. D. M. 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 <laughs> Rocked. Rock. Broken. Ah, I know. Should do it with your hand. O. There is R. Wash. H. H. No, no. Reading. I. I. T. E. And. And. S. Ah. Mm. Oh. D. Yes. R. R. I. I. V. 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 E. E. N. 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 Sleep. L. E. Slept. It end. A. T. N. N. War. W. W. No. D. Drink. R. 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 A. What's possible? You. You. Drunk. Me. N. Drunk. N. N. K. 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 And the last one. Barring for B B B B or V B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B B
Sí. A. B. B. Invited. I. M. Sí. 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 Excellent. Very good. Okay. Very good. Excellent. So we are practicing the past participle of the verbs. And when do we use the past participle of the verbs? Well, we commonly use it um, with the present perfect, past perfect, a passive voice. Okay, I'm going to leave a link here in the chat. I don't know if someone can share the link, uh, WhatsApp group, for you to practice the past participle of the verbs. Finish. No, teachers. Done. Not yet. Not yet. No yet? Finish. Finish. Good. Finish. 
finish the job. Finish the show. All right, thank you. Finish the show. Okay, here we go. Finish. How about brain? Broad. Broad. B. R. 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 U. 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 Brought. 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 B. 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 E. E. Yeah. Begun. They come. Sale. S. 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 F. L. L. D. L. D. So. Forget. F. Got him. F. F. O. R. 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 G. G. D. O. O. T. T. Okay. Mm. For garden. For garden. Very good. Thing. T. T. O. 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 Thought. Thought. Where? W. W. O. 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 Warn. Warn. Number seven, hide. Hiding. H. H. S. E. Hidden. Hidden. M. 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 E. T. M. E. T. Met. Met. E. A T T E N Eden W R R N T T T T N Written Written Broke. Broke. B. B. Sorry. B. B. R. 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 O. O. K. 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 Broken. And the last one. Fight. F. 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 Fold. U. 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 But. But, but. Okay, excellent. So we practice today the past participle of the verbs. All right, also the reading, the exercise with enough adjective or noun adjective, noun enough. So also the vocabulary. So something that I want to ask you, it is to do the homework, please. Okay, to do the homework. And let me see. Also, at the we are close to start doing the midterm. So please work on the if you have the chance to work on the midterm, please do it. And I'm going to start taking the attendance list. So help me with the cameras. Turn on your cameras before to start taking the attendance list. Thank you very much. I appreciate your 
collaboration. All right, let's start. When you listen to your name, say hi or present. Hernández Sotelo. Maribel Ramos. Calderón de López. Present. Alvarado de Benavides. Present. Guerrero Molina. Present, teacher. López González. Present, teacher. Rugamas Melara. Present. Santana González. Present. España Marroquín. Alvarado Mejía. Present. León Rivera. Present, teacher. Castaneda Velasco. Present, teacher. Romero Ayala. Present, teacher. Rosibel Hernández. Present. Molina de García. Present. López de Cabrera. Present, teacher. All right. So today, right now, we're going to stop right here with the class number seven. All right. Tomorrow, we have class number eight. Remember, this course has 25 classes. 25 classes. We're going to end it up the class by November 20, very close to Christmas. Okay, see you tomorrow. God see bless you. Tomorrow. And good night. Good night. Good night, Joe. Thank you. I'm here, teacher. I'm sorry. I, I didn't hear my, my name. I'm sorry. Miss Spanish Marroquin. Okay, sorry. don't worry. Yes. Good night, teacher. I'm sorry. Good night. <laughs>